Hi, this is a Shop Integrator shopping cart uh, admin demo for the shipping manager to show you how to create a shipping plan that will um, have variable costs based upon the order cost uh, of the shopper as they uh, move through the checkout. So I'm going to use this order costs per delivery zone plan and I'm going to just call it postage and packaging and I'm going to say add new shipping plan. So this um, this shipping plan, you'll see that I've already created delivery zones and put my countries into those delivery zones. So if you've seen um, it telling you there's no zones, please see the earlier video tutorial for the introduction to shipping that will show you the setup of countries and creating delivery zones and putting your countries into the delivery zones ready to create a shipping plan, um, which will then allow you to create the shipping plan like we are doing now. So I've only activated a few countries and put these into the different um, zone group names that I've defined. So what this says here is that for um, any order that uh, we have at the moment for zero dollars or above, for greater than or equal to, um, I'm going to charge, say, two dollars to ship to my zone one, my United States. I'm going to charge three dollars to ship to the zone two, my European zone, and five dollars to ship to my zone three my um, rest of world zone for those countries so what i also want to do is i'm going to show that actually when the order reaches ten dollars in value then for zone one i'm going to say now it's now going to cost um four dollars to ship and it's going to cost five dollars to ship to zone two and seven dollars to ship to zone three so for order value of um, anything above equal to zero in up to nine dollars ninety nine it's going to charge these set of prices when the order value reaches um, ten dollars it's going to charge these set of prices and I can keep adding um, these order cost bands so I'm going to say when the order value reaches $20, I will charge a new set of prices. Um, say $5, $6, and $8. And however, for orders of $50 or more for the United States, um, for my home region, I'm going to offer free shipping. So I'm going to say the shipping cost for the United States when the order value reaches $50 or more is going to be um, zero it's going to be free shipping but i don't want to offer free shipping to the other areas my other delivery zones such as europe and the rest of the world because that's too expensive to ship to there to offer free shipping so i'm just going to set those at the same values of six and eight dollars so um what we're saying is here when the order value reaches fifty dollars zone one us united states will be free shipping and these other order values will trigger these other order costs. Um, if you're using tax, please note that the values we're defining here are the excluding um, tax costs. So tax will be added on based on the, the tax manager settings that you've added. So now when I click Save All Changes, um, this shipping plan is now saying reviewed, not active in the checkout, uh, which means there is there won't be a new stage in the checkout yet until we activate this shipping plan and we say yes so now there will be a new step in the checkout for delivery where the shopper will see that there's a postage and packaging shipping option and they will have to enter other details regarding the um, shipping stage so if we were to add multiple shipping plans and activate those then the shopper would have multiple shipping plans to choose from so you might want a um, shipping plan for a 48 hour delivery and you might want a shipping plan for um, a seven day delivery that's cheaper so this is the order costs per delivery zone so we showed you how we could change the shipping costs charged based upon the cost of the order um, of for the items and it could be variable across the different delivery zones the different countries that we had